Oh, this looks great. I should have taken you lot to the meeting with me. You might have got the contract. Well, then I thought the hotel deal was a dead cert. Oh, apparently the manager didn't realise I was a one-woman band. Didn't think I could handle the workload. Short-sighted fool. Right, I've named this one a... Stop, Yvette. Uh, and the other one's a dodgy dingle. We might want to work on the names, but, um, bottoms up. <coughs> oh, are you OK? Too much Tabasco. <laughs> Too... Ah, in your bed. No, no, no. no. Uh, toilet. Wow. This is amazing. Oh, cheers. You could neck one of these if you weren't brewing up a bundle of joy. We won't need everything to be perfect for tomorrow. Yeah, well, it's not every day you make an honest man of the pasta. Thank you all. You're fantastic. Nice work, ladies. <laughs> I think someone's a bit tired. Yeah, come on, Samson, let's go. Well, I'm glad you're not. Dad. Hey, you. You're Behave. Fine. See you later. Well, you're doing that smiling when you're really sad thing. Tell me why. This problem with the heart, um, the doctors have been trying to fix it, but it's become a little bit more urgent. Well, then I get a transplant sooner. Well, yeah. Yeah, hopefully. But they've got to wait for you to get rid of the virus first. They won't operate while you've got that. So, I need a new heart, but I'm too ill to get one. That must mean that I'm going to die soon. No! Babe, it means you're top priority. And in the best place. But it also means you have to stay here in hospital. What? So I can't go home at all? Well, I'm going to be here the whole time. Listen, I know you don't always want to tell me everything. You're growing up. I get that. I should have just said I felt ill. I'm sorry. I'm not angry with you. But I'm your mum and I want to love and care for you. So if there is something, please, please don't shut me out, OK? You're going to get better, I promise. <laughs>